On occasion, universities award honorary degrees. We use the Latin phrase honoris causa, which, translate, which translates for the sake of the honor to describe these degrees. We award honorary degrees to individuals who have distinguished themselves through their contributions to the university, to a specific field, or to society in general. Today, we honor two such people. At the 176th commencement, the May Exercises, the University of Notre Dame du Lac confers the degree of Doctor of Laws honoris causa on an alumnus who left the presidency of one of the nation's leading liberal arts universities to return to his beloved alma mater as provost, where he shepherded the university's academic efforts for 15 years in perhaps its most significant period of advancement thus far, taking the university to new heights and greatly enhancing its reputation among the world's leading universities. As he recruited some of the best scholars and teachers in the world, as well as the most talented and diverse undergraduate student body in the university's history, oversaw an unprecedented 250% increase in research investment and dramatically enhanced Notre Dame's international reach, including through the creation of the Keough School of Global Affairs and the establishment of global gateways around the world. This award-winning teacher, groundbreaking researcher, and visionary leader worked tirelessly to advance the university's distinctive Catholic mission. Whether studying how to help cancer patients better cope with emotional and physical pain of illness, mentoring scores of higher education leaders, both here at Notre Dame and at the other institutions he served, or dropping by North Dining Hall to share a meal with undergraduate students, his characteristic generosity, kindness, and compassion inspire and illumine all that he does. The University of Notre Dame du Lac confers the degree of Doctor of Laws honoris causa on Thomas G. Burrish of Granger, Indiana.